Are we live? You are. Oh, okay. <laughs> I thought you were going to play a little bit. He's doing the sign. <laughs> <laughs> Hello, everyone. Welcome back to FFG Live. Uh, my name is Evan Johnson, and I'm joined here today by Molly Glover and Andrew Fisher. So today we have here Fallout Shelter, the board game, uh, which is a, an awesome game we announced a couple of months ago, uh, kind of you know drawing from the, the mobile app Fallout Shelter. Uh, Fisher, you you made this game. This I did. this came out of your brain, uh, <laughs> fully formed like Athena. Oh yeah, um, of course. Exactly how it was. <laughs> Not at all a year long. <laughs> uh, tell me a little bit about this. What is what is going on with this guy? Yeah, so like you said, uh, Fallout Shelter is based on the mobile game by the same <laughs> name. So uh, we are in a vault in the Fallout universe after the apocalypse, mm -hmm. uh, kind of surviving in the wasteland. Yeah. Um, these vaults are overseen by the, the overseer. Um, unfortunately, our overseer has died. Um, we are the officers left in the vault, and it is up to us. One of us is going to become the new overseer of our vault at the end of the game. Um, there's going to be an election, and whichever one of us can generate the most happiness, uh, those little tokens over there, um, is going to be elected as the new overseer of our vault at the end of the game. So. Uh, we're going to be generating this happiness by kind of taking our little dwellers here. Mm -hmm. um, we are just going to start with two of them, but you can gain more throughout the game. And we're going to be placing them throughout the vault um, to generate resources, uh, energy, food, and water for the vault. Mm -hmm. Spending those resources to do things like creating more dwellers, building new rooms in our vault, and fighting off different threats that invade our vault. All in an attempt to uh, increase the happiness of our vault and gain the most happiness for ourselves so that we become the new overseer. Happy Pro dwellers are productive dwellers. Yes. <laughs> yes. So, so basically, uh, similar to, to many worker placement games, we have these little guys that will be going around to gain benefits. And we have on each card like the space that we place them, uh, the costs that we have to pay, if any, and then the rewards that we get up top. All right. What are the letters uh, in the spaces? What do those signify? Oh, those letters are the uh, special stats. So uh, for those of you who've played Fallout, you're, you may be aware of the kind of special stats you can get, which are strength, perception, endurance, charisma, intelligence, agility, and luck. Mm. Uh, don't worry, you won't need to remember that for the game itself. <laughs> um, we'll be able to train our dwellers in those different stats throughout the game by going to spaces with these little arrows. Um, at the end of a round in which your dweller has been placed on one of these training spaces, they'll get trained in one of these stats and placed here along with the stat. That means that dweller for the next round is, is going to be better at that stat than other dwellers. And if they go to a space that matches that stat, they're going to get twice the rewards. Oh, wow. Mm -hmm. That's crazy. So, so if your guy's trained in, in, in S, uh, in strength, yep. and then you go here with, with the S, then you would get four energy. Yeah, four energy saying. instead of two. So that's kind of a way to kind of plan ahead and uh, you know use your different options to maximize your payout per dweller. Okay. Awesome. Uh, so we have kind of our own levels of the vault as well, correct? Yeah, so um, each of us has a, the elevator with the light in our color. Mm. That's kind of the level of the vault that we individually are over seeing as officers of this vault. Yes. Um, right now, our, our, our levels of the vault are looking a little uh, miserably empty, mm -hmm. but we're going to change that. So yes. um, you'll see here there's actually a space on each of our own elevators that's color coded to your color. Only you can go to that space, but it allows you to build a new room in your level of the vault. Ah. So if I go here, I get to choose one of the rooms available uh, in this track here, pay the resources in the bottom right of that room, mm -hmm take it and add it to my level of the vault. And you also score some happiness for doing that. Yeah, it's one of the main ways of getting happiness, getting the victory points uh, alongside different items that will give it and defeating threats that invade our vault. But building rooms is one of the most reliable ways to get happiness. Sure. So the other benefit of building these rooms is that it adds new spaces to our vault that we can go to. And a lot of the rooms that will be coming out uh, have much better spaces than the ones that start here at the oh, top. Sure. And so you're going to want to add rooms you think the other players are going to want to visit because when other players come to your level of vault, you're going to get some rewards. You're going to get uh, a cube that you can add to one of your resource tracks of your choice. So it's a pretty big benefit when people try to come to your level of the vault and use your rooms. Sure. So keep an eye out for rooms you think other people are going to want to use and mm -hmm. make sure to build those ones. Okay. Fantastic. And so the game ends when someone has completed their entire level. 
Um, yep. And then whoever has the most happiness wins. Yep. Uh, the, at the end of the round in which somebody completes their level, we'll play out the rest of that round. We'll place all of our different dwellers on the board. And yeah. then at the end, we'll score up. All right. Uh, Exciting. Alter alternatively, if we ever run out of this deck of threats, that can also end the game if we're mm -hmm. doing a slow job at building. <laughs> right. And we're playing three player today, but how many people can play the game? Uh, this is up to four players. Sure. Um, it can also two, go two down to four. Huh? Yep. It yep. can also go down to two players as well. Okay. Perfect. Well, uh, let's, exciting. You guys ready to dive in? Let's do it. Oh, yeah. right. Get those yeah. resources out there. Oh yeah. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> Reset the board. It was example resources. Um, all right. Uh, so I'm first player. Yes. So I'm going to start us off. Okay. Um, and you're just going to place one of your little guys. Yep. So I'm going to take one of these dwellers and, oh. and put it out. Um, I think that starting with some food is probably going to be pretty good here. Shh. So I'm going to go there food. and take two resources and put them in my food track here. And you take it, so you take the reward immediately once you place that. Yep, yeah. immediately okay. upon placing. The only exception to that is those training spaces, mm. which uh, you'll train the dweller when you recall them. Perfect. But otherwise, all the rewards are done when you place. All right. Well, uh, I don't need food. I need lightning powers. Dang so you, Evan. I'm going to get some energy right there. Yes. Okay. All right. Well, I am going to train a dude. Mm -hmm. oh. Put my friend right there for now. All right. Well... Some of those items look pretty good, and they're, they're going to cost me water, so yeah. I'm going to grab a water space. A little bit of water. Mm -hmm. uh, I will, let's see, I, I don't have resources to pay for anything. I'm also going to take some water. Again, Evan. <laughs> oh, man. All right, you well. take first player. I will absolutely get some power here, so. Oh, and so I could have taken first player. Oh, yeah. So this space here, uh, if you go there, uh, you'll gain the first player token, and next round, ah, you'll be the person who goes first. Very um, cool. Additionally, you'll be able to train in luck. Um, if, if you go to a training spot that has a specified letter, you have to train that dweller in that letter. All right. The one without the letter, you can go and train in any stat. Next time, Gadget. Um, yeah, so <laughs> next time, you can get the jump on us. Um, but now we've placed all of the dwellers we currently have. Yep. We just have two each. So that's going to be the end of this round. So what we do is we can recall all of our dwellers. So just grab your dwellers and bring them back to your um, area of the board. Come on home, boys. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna go and then, uh, with S. Then some, uh, some bad things can show up. Oh yeah, that. so the, the one last thing we're gonna do is uh, threats can potentially show up in our vaults. These can be raiders, monsters, uh, fire, <laughs> just generally bad things that happen to our vault. Fire sure. sounds bad. <laughs> yeah. So what we're going to do is these kind of randomly show up. So what we're going to do is we're going to roll the uh, those dice uh, that, that came with here. Um, and six. six. All, right. All right. So um, along the top row here of our vault, there's going to be these little numbers acting as reminders on each space um, for which number each space corresponds to. So mm -hmm. these kind of go up through all the different results mm -hmm. we can possibly get. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, et cetera. Sure. Mm -hmm. um, we are going to draw the top threat here. Yeah. And we're going to place it on the space matching throw, the number. Throw this guy in the little card shot so you can see it. Uh, so you can, you can see it appearing here in a second, but this doesn't really do it justice because this is actually a transparent card. Maybe if I hold it out a little <laughs> bit. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> so, which means that it's going to, as it goes now to its place on the board, you can see the room behind it, which is pretty cool. Uh, yeah. It's too far away, Evan. Can you bring it up? Just hold, or, pull the whole card up, I would say. Oh, like, uh, yeah. yeah, put it right there. So you can see on the sixth space, we've got a pretty cool looking raider who is definitely going to mess us up. <laughs> yes. So now we can, we can no longer do the thing that was on that space. Uh, but we can go and fight that raider, correct? Yeah, so the, the threats are going to fully replace whatever space they go over. So unfortunately, um, she's blocked us from using our training space for now. But we can go and free up that space by uh, fighting her. Mm -hmm. So if we send a dweller uh, to that space, we can attempt to fight the raider. Mm -hmm. um, you'll notice that the cost space above her, that the cost of that space indicates it shows the dice and then a nine plus. What that means is you have to roll the dice and get a nine or higher on the result. Mm -hmm. um, if you do, you've defeated her and you'll get the reward listed above her. However, sure. if you uh, fail to, to get to reach that number, if you get an eight or lower, 
uh, your dweller has been defeated by the raider and becomes injured. What that means is you won't get the reward and you have to knock your, your little dweller oh, over. Oh no. Um, your dweller stays knocked over until you heal them. So they'll recall just like a normal dweller and be knocked over mm -hmm. and you're unable to use this dweller at any of the normal spaces, but you can send them here to mm. this space with the little sad dweller face on it. <laughs> um, they get that, a stim pack. Yep, that stim pack indicates that you'll be able to heal them. So you basically lose a turn if you lose that fight. Sure. sure. Um, one uh, kind of tip is that there are some <laughs> items that help you out, like this shotgun will give you plus two to your roll against that, okay. that raider. So okay. before we fight her, we might want to go and you know grab a weapon mm -hmm. and, and gear up ahead of time. That seems mm -hmm. logical. All right, well, uh, so this is now the second round and uh, you are kicking off again. Oh yeah, I'm, I'm still first player. Well, yeah. uh, I, I talked a lot about that weapon and, and I grabbed the water specifically to dig an item. So I'll go here to the wasteland, mm -hmm. spend that water to take that shotgun yeah. and maybe I can go take that raider on. All right, so a new item pops out when you, uh, when you claim that. So now we have a jumpsuit. Mm. Which you can exhaust to train someone in agility. We have this lab coat that you can exhaust to train someone in intelligence, and this golden retriever that you can exhaust to ready another item. All right. Uh, I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go grab some water. Seems reasonable. Uh, I'm gonna send my uh, S-trained guy here to get four. Oh, oh crap! Power. We should have energy. Maybe blocked yeah. her on that. <laughs> what? No. We're all just friends in the same vault, right? We're just. We all just want to help everybody. Yeah, definitely. <laughs> But I also want to beat you at the coming election. So. <laughs> ah, thank you. Yeah. All right. Well, I, I got this shotgun, so I'll, I'll go try to take on that that yeah. raider. Yeah. This this won't go sideways. I'm excited. Yeah. <laughs> I'm gonna die here and lose horribly at the stream of my own game. All right. So uh -huh. uh, I'll exhaust my shotgun. Uh, most items require you to exhaust them to use their abilities. So this here, is gonna give me that card. Oh yeah. This is going to give me plus two to my roll here. So instead of a nine plus, I'll just need a seven plus on these dice. Yes. Oh. Oh. Uh. Put him in the suit, fish. Oh. Thank you. Yep. There's your shotgun. <laughs> yeah. So even with the plus two, still Dude, only a no. six. It's exhausted. Yep. And your guy is down. All right. All right. Well, do not worry, fellow executives of the vault. <laughs> I'm gonna build a room here. It's gonna be some nice living Ooh, quarters for living everyone. Quarters. Yep. Uh, potential to get more dwellers for your vault. Now I see that there are two spaces with a little link symbol. Does that mean I have to put two dwellers there to get it or? Yep. Okay. Uh, so when you go there, uh, as, as kind of one turn, one placement of workers, you'll place two okay. instead of one. Excellent. So we have a game room coming out now. Ooh. Uh, all right. That's that pretty is... meta. <laughs> <laughs> all right, uh, I am going to go here to the diner and get two food. Oh, I suppose I should pay my resources for uh, mm -hmm. for my room. No, yeah, I suppose. You that, also took your happiness? I did take my happiness. All right, so Evan's a happy. I generated two happiness. happiness. Yeah. All right, that's it. Um, All right, yep. so threats. Yep, so uh, we're going to roll for threats again on the top level. Mm -hmm. um, if we roll the same spot that a threat is already in, mm -hmm. a new one won't spawn. Also, if you ever roll a seven, uh, nothing spawns in, the, in that kind of center aisle. In the elevator. Um, yeah. Additionally, we roll actually for each level of the vault. Oh. So we didn't roll for our own levels last turn because <laughs> all we had is that elevator where things don't spawn. Right. Um, but now we'll have Evan for... has a room. So yes. on a uh, eight or a nine, you could potentially get a threat on your level of the vault. You won't so. roll an eight or a nine. <laughs> so let's roll for this top level first. Seven. On a seven, seven. Okay. as we okay. said, nothing ever spawns in that center seven space. So mm -hmm. we're spared from a threat this round here. But on Evan's level, Come on, eight or nine. No, it's fine. No! Yeah! <laughs> All right, put those rad roaches covering that space. Evan. Oh, no. Uh, that's okay. I'll clean them out. All right. So what do you get? What's the reward for killing them? It says question mark. Oh, yes, that's right. So question marks, you'll see a couple um, on one of the room costs as well. Those are a resource of your choice. So oh. you can choose any uh, cube from any of your three tracks to pay those Very or cool. when you gain them. So. When someone comes down to my level of the vault, I get a resource of my choice. If they come down to fight a monster, do I still get a resource? No, they're doing oh. you a favor. So it's only if they go to your room itself, not if they go to a threat on top of your room. That makes sense. All right. All right. Recall. Yep. All right. Come on back here, boys. <laughs> All right, you're still first player. Yeah, so I'm first player. I, have, I kind of have a choice here. I really want to kill that raider. <laughs> now it's personal. <laughs> but if I injure myself again, I'm just going to fall way too far behind on this screen. Um, 
I can't go to Evan's living quarters since one of my guys is injured. So mm. I think I'm gonna go and grab some more food. That double food space is gonna help me get more dwellers. Uh, let's see, I am going to, I'm gonna take a new dweller. Do I get this person immediately? Um, so what you're gonna do is you're gonna take one of the dwellers from your additional dweller mm -hmm. supply here mm -hmm. and just place them up on that icon uh, as a reminder. Right. So okay. when we recall at the end of this round, you'll gain that new dweller in addition to the others you've recalled. You'll okay. have uh, that dweller for the rest of the game. All right, perfect. Hmm. All right. This person is ready to join the team. I'm very excited because I can't, I, I'm going to build something, but I don't know what to build. Oh, there's, there's two options that are, that are pretty cool here. I could build the game room or I could build the garden. And I like the game room because people get injured. And, and then they get happiness. happiness right? <laughs> you get in the brawl, you know, yeah, yeah. just, just a friendly get brawl. A fight. Over okay, a game. just go solo a game for a little while. All That's right, you know happened. what? So, yeah, I'm going to go to my lovely third level here and I am going to build, I'm going to build that game room. Mm. So, uh, I will spend one energy and four yeah, of your one energy and I'm going to spend three energy and a food. Nice. Kind of balance it out a bit. And the game room will be right here. I'm assuming I can't put it over here because they wouldn't be able to get there. Yep, that's right. It has to be okay. next to your elevator or next to a room you've already built. That makes sense. All right. All right, let's flip up our new room. Ooh, the new mm. Coca-Cola bottler. Ooh. Oh, that one's so good. That looks really good. Yeah, a little bit, a little bit of food, a little bit of water on that one. Um, all right, well, my only other dweller is injured, so I'm going to have to go heal them up mm -hmm. on my turn. I've used both of mine. Okay. They're, uh, uh, they're I will a get, baby. I'm going to get some water. So now I have a little bit of everything. Sweet. All right. That's the end of the round. Okay. Um, let's recall our dwellers. Do we recall and then place threats? Yeah, actually okay. we do. Because in case you have to place it on a space there's oh, already a sure. meeple on. That makes sense. All right. So for the top level here, we'll roll on an eight. eight. We mm. do. This fire breaks out oh. actually in the water treatment plant. That's, oh, no. Oh, no. <laughs> the irony. <laughs> <laughs> um, all right, on Evan's level here, the only result that's going to get you another threat is an eight, so you're pretty safe. Oh, yeah, a seven. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> close, but you're safe from a threat. That's really close. Super safe. Leave my game room alone. All right, Molly, on, all right. on a five or a six, something is going to spawn in your game room. Yay! Yeah, yeah, yeah. you're right. safe as well. Oh, goodness. All right, well, I'm still first player. Yeah, we should probably do something about that. Yeah. <laughs> well, I've got all this food, so I'm going to go to... Uh, do I want to save the food? No, I want the extra dwellers uh, for this turn. So I'm going to go here, spend three food. Mm -hmm. That's and so expensive. Gain that additional dweller. You could have just sent both of you guys. So now you gain the dweller there. on recall, I'm guessing, right? You don't get it right away to place that round. Yeah, that's right. That so sense. it's, it's kind of locked down there mm -hmm. until the end of the round. All right. Let's see here. Um, I am thinking that I will do, uh, let's go get some energy. That is what we are about. Getting energy. All right, I'm gonna go put out this fire, everyone. Don't worry, <laughs> I got it. Thank you, it's Molly. It's great. I got some water here, coincidentally, in the water plant. So I'll take a happiness. Yep, nice. the reward is a happiness. And so the fire goes away Goodbye. now or later? Um, at, at the end of the round. Okay, so, so I stay here now, so um, we know. Yeah. So when we recall from a threat, mm -hmm. if your dweller is standing up, we know that you were successful against that threat and we'll recall it. But um, earlier when I got injured when right. fighting this raider, um, when I recalled, we didn't remove that threat because we the, because the dweller was injured. So Got at the it. end of the round, we'll just need to make sure to remove it. Wonderful. All right. Perfect. Back to you, Fish. Yeah, no problem. Also, I just noticed uh, uh, you did build the game room earlier. Oh, and I, I didn't need to remember take, to take two happiness. I didn't take so. my happiness for building. Thank so you for happy. reminding me. So with that, with putting out that fire, you've pulled ahead of Evan here. Mm. In the early game. Mm. I guess I'm just really invested in the vaults and maybe the rest of you aren't. <laughs> you just seem to be willing to let fire run rampant. All right. Yeah. We'll, we'll see who's com no comes in against the Raiders with their shotgun yeah, later. I'm going to go film my election commercial now. <laughs> <laughs> Evan Johnson doesn't care about fire. <laughs> Soft on fire. <laughs> Partying in the living quarters with the rad roaches. <laughs> He's a terrible landlord. <laughs> Oh, so I'm a little torn. I I really want to take the risk again against that raider. Do it. It's personal. <laughs> it's she, personal. She said things about your mama. <laughs> and she's got. I, I want to grab your a couple. Poor, I grab long grab dead one mama. of these items. You have a fifty percent chance of winning. It's better a seven up on two dice. That's better than fifty percent. You're right. I should go for it. <laughs> yeah. Okay, exhaust my shotgun again for a plus, plus two. Plus, if you get sick can I, or injured, can I recommend a game room to ease your pain? <laughs> <laughs> uh, all right. Hey! 
<laughs> I got it. So, Very well done. Um, her reward is an item, so I get to choose one of these items up here. Um, I could get the jumps or the golden retriever to be able to use my shotgun again. <laughs> <laughs> nothing dangerous about that. <laughs> Send your dog to go get the Reload gun. my gun, <laughs> yeah. Um But I'm going to take this jumpsuit. <sighs> All right, I think we can all agree that dog's name is Trigger. We get a <laughs> missile launcher. Ooh. Exhaust after fighting to re-roll both dice. Ooh. Use the new result. You thought your dog helping out with the shotgun was dangerous. <laughs> <Right. laughs> uh, let's just go uh, add more dwellers Dang. to the vault. Good call. More people. All right, um, I'm going to get some more food because I think that's a path to get some more dwellers soon. All right. All right. Uh, I think that's all of us. All right, we're all out. Mm -hmm. so, all right, end of the round. So recall, recall, back, get rid of that off. fire. And the raider. Yep, the raider. get rid of that raider. All right, our vault's looking better already. Um, but we have to roll again. Mm -hmm. So for the top level, uh, we've got a five. So that's ah, going to be a glowing one. A glowing one. <laughs> food space. No worries, they're fine. <laughs> um, and then for Evan's level, uh, Seven, you're nice. safe again, yes. and then on Molly's level for the game room. No! Oh, five. My game room! <laughs> uh, it's, a, it's just another ghoul. This one's not even glowing. Molly it's, Glover it fraternizes is. with feral ghouls. <laughs> <laughs> this is no game. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Uh, this is so fun. <laughs> uh, All right. Well, I was going to use my jumpsuit to, to, to train... Uh, no, you know what? I, I'm... I'm still gonna do it. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna use my jumpsuit here so I can exhaust to train one of my dwellers immediately in, in A, and mm -hmm. I'll do that right now. So now that dweller's trained in A, mm -hmm. and I'll immediately place that dweller here on the diner to get four food. Whoa. Nice. Here's, so here's just hoping food. that uh, somebody with their handy dandy shotgun can clear <laughs> off that space. Is it your dog? <laughs> <laughs> uh, it's not my dog, Matt. I'll get triggered soon. Let's see here. Um... How do I want to do this? Let's go and get some. No, I need I need some food. Yeah, it's gonna take some food. All right, I definitely need some water. I'm low. I'm a little behind on the room game, so I'm gonna grab two power. Mm -hmm. Let's grab some water. All right. I would like an item, please. Mm -hmm. Spend the water, which spend the water, boy. Let's see. The lab coat looks good. I don't need trigger because I don't have any other items right now. But you know, well, uh, we don't have a lot of. We currently don't have a lot of eye. There on isn't the a lot of eye, so I think I'm going to take that missile launcher. Yeah, yeah, maybe go uh, obliterate some rad roaches. <laughs> <laughs> Doesn't seem like overkill at all. <laughs> Not at all. Now we have a camera at the end of the game one happiness for every two of your dwellers. Oh, so that's something that, oh, very cool. Yeah, so uh, that's kind of the one other type of item. Most items are gonna exhaust to give you bonuses right away. Uh, these, uh, these kind of uh, gear items are going to be giving you happiness at the end of the game based on different conditions. Hmm. So this one's for every two dwellers. So if you think you're gonna have a, a full stable of dwellers by the end of the game, it's probably a good item to go for. Very mm -hmm. cool. All right, so it's Molly, so yep. I'm up. Yep. Well, I have one guy left. might as well use my shotgun. I'm going to go fight that glowing one here. Nice. So this is an 8 plus, but with my shotgun, I just need a 6 plus. Surely you'll get that. Hey, hey. all right. So that gives me a happiness. I'm dead. And we'll, re we'll get to remove that glowing one at the end of the round. All right. Uh, oh, am I the only one with Tyler's You lights? are. All right. Let's grab an energy. And then we're going to continue expanding our Ooh. level of the vault. So... That's all of that. Let's bring in the Nuka Cola bottle. Very cool. Bottler. Two more. Two more happiness, happiness for you. Yes. Want to reveal another room for us? Yes, of course I do. It's a nuclear reactor. Ooh. Very safe to have. <laughs> <laughs> Molly should go use her missile launcher in there. It takes power to make power. <laughs> <laughs> Can't argue with that. All right. Um, I'm out of dwellers, so yep, this me is too. it for me. All right. All right. So let's recall. Okay. Get rid of this glowing one here. Oh my goodness, come to me, small dweller. All right, so spawning some more threats. So at the top level here, uh, on the nine, so that's gonna go on the other area of the water treatment. Uh, then on Evan's level here, no. an 11, and unfortunately you just built that brand new Nuka Cola uh. bottler. 
So we've got a rad scorpion there. And then in Molly's level. It's pretty rad, I guess. <laughs> only only a six, but the death claws come up. Oh so. boy. Oh, you're fine. Oh, okay. All right. <laughs> The death claw is just patiently waiting his turn to come in. He's just outside. Like, I, mean, I love this mobile game, so I'm just picturing him outside the door, you know, on the yeah, top just level, <laughs> just like, waiting anyone? His turn. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> All right. Um, what are my priorities here? I think, I think I actually want, I want some training. Mm-hmm. Makes sense. Uh, let's send... Hmm. Your level is infested. <laughs> I know. I, need, I really need to clean it out. But I'm not so good at fighting. Uh, hopefully I can squish these rad roaches. Ooh, exciting. Oh, no weapon. So you nope. just have a... Luckily, the rad roaches are kind of weak. It's yeah, just a five big, up. Yeah, big boot. Yeah, yeah. This, will, this will be fine. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Uh, Resources your choice. Should have gone after the rad scorpion. Um, let's see. I'm gonna take some water. All right. Well, I need people, so I'm gonna spend three food here oh, now crap. that that now that that raider's gone, or whatever it was, the glowing one, and get uh, another dweller. Oh my guys, there we go. Right there. It's mm -hmm. my next move, Molly. Aha! Uh -huh. You can always come to the living quarters. Yeah, you've got yeah. enough dudes to spend down there. Grumble, grumble. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna get a little more power here. Gonna finally build myself a room. Power. So that my level can be infested too. <laughs> uh, let's see. Let's go for... I'm gonna go for an, an item here. I'm gonna spend that water. Let's grab the camera. I'm gonna take pictures of all my many people. Oh, we got Ooh. another weapon. Minigun, a plus three. Oh. Very cool. All right. My little guy here is flexing his muscles, so we're gonna go fight this rad scorpion with my missile Ooh, launcher. Okay, yeah. all right. All right, so. That missile launcher can give you a reroll, right? If I need it, let's right. hope I don't. I need an eight or higher. Ooh! <laughs> all right. Well, hopefully, we'll be reloading the missile launcher. That was snake eyes. Uh, so, all right, here we go. Come on. Hey! hey I got I'm a 10. 10. Hooray! All right, so I get a happiness and a resource of my choice. I'm gonna take water. All right. All right, what do I want here? <laughs> what do I want out of life? Yeah. <laughs> oh, I'm gonna... Oh, it's five power. I really like this little happy face. <laughs> it's so happy. It's so happy. It's delightful. <laughs> here. <laughs> All right, I'm gonna grab a power. <laughs> <laughs> it's beautiful. Uh, I'm gonna make more people. I'm out of dwellers, so. I'm also out of dwellers. All right. All right, that's it. Come on back. Call. Yep. Remember to discard your threats that you recalled from. Mm -hmm. Oh yes. With my training guy here, I'm gonna train and see. Cunning. Charisma. Charisma. Mm -hmm. To make me more charming in the living quarters. Well, what about cunning? <laughs> <laughs> All right, so we're spawning more threats. Yep. Top level first on a five. Ooh, oh, man, a, again. Oh, and this is the death claw. The oh. death claw is pretty brutal. Mm. It's got. It's worth two happiness, but it's a linked space. So you have to send two dwellers to fight it. Um, I'm still roomless, <laughs> but on Evan's level here, uh, a six, yeah. nothing. And then lastly on Molly's level. A two, so nothing. Great. All right, so, so we've still got some options here. Well, I'm gonna get a jump on this and immediately send my trained, dweller trained in C, mm -hmm. as well as one other dweller, yep. to the living quarters. And since I get double the reward, I get to put two dwellers up there. That's pretty mm -hmm. good. Very cool. You're twins. <laughs> <laughs> uh, let's see here. I am going to... Grab that first player. Too. No! Oh. My reign has ended. Yeah. I need to train an L when it comes train back, L. too. Yep. All right, I need some power, so two power to me. Leadership. <laughs> <laughs> I just come up with different ones. This is, this is my this bit is now. Sass. <laughs> Panache. <laughs> Excellence. But that's just going to watch this and be like, what are you guys doing? Um, 
All right, well, so I had originally been building towards that garden, but because your mm. living quarters doesn't need food as much to, to build dwellers, mm. I decided, I, I went for the extra power last round, and I'm, I'm gonna build, oh, mm. you're building that something. nuclear reactor. Oh, Ooh. I didn't take a resource when you uh, came to my living quarters. That's oh true. yeah, feel All free. Right. Let's uh, take some food. All right, so no, that gives energy. me two happiness. Energy. Very nice. And our new room is an athletics room. Mm. You can train in A and get some happiness. You spend some food to get happy. I've yeah. already got this jumpsuit. I don't, I don't need <laughs> athletics. I'm just lounging in my jumpsuit. Let's see here. How do we want to do this? Um, I will... What do I want to build next? What do we got here? <laughs> got some got some good stuff. Uh, let's take some. I'm gonna go for oh, two food and a water. Curse you! All right, well I'll just take one food and a water then. Oh, thank you. I will grab. Uh huh. Resource. You're welcome. Yep, I do appreciate your business. <laughs> <laughs> Well, I'm out of dwellers already. <sighs> Going to those double spaces uh, yeah. uses them up quickly. Mm. Let's uh, let's let's build again. Very cool. <laughs> so three food and an energy makes an athletics room. Oh, all right. With some happiness here. What do you got now? Six. I'm at six happiness. All right. Six happy. I too am gonna build a room. I'm gonna build this. Oh, I'm sorry. We should flip the room oh, first yeah, to yeah. see oh, if I yes. want to build something else so I can build a radio station. Mm. I could build that radio station. <laughs> I mean, you get more dwellers that way with food, but I think instead I'm going to build the outfit workshop. Yeah, that's pretty good. It gives it us that extra cool. item space. So that's three mm. energy and two water, and let's put it right here. Balance in all things. All right. <laughs> Make sure to take your happiness as well. Oh, yes, thank you. Yep. Two more happiness for me. Oh, you're, you're yep, out again. still out. Yeah, still out. Me too, so mm. it's all you now. Okay, all right, all right, all right. You got, you got the run of the vault. Yes. For two whole dwellers. Yes. <laughs> These dwellers. Um, These dwellers. <laughs> I'm gonna go get an item because I, I want to have a weapon. Take that mini gun. Gonna grab that mini gun, and then I'm gonna take. Oh, we need to put the other room out. Mm, a science lab. Interesting. Oh, just interesting, place, it's basically just a place to heal your guys. Oh yep. no! It's, if it's, you heal, you get extra. Yeah, so it's kind of like the healing space, but you'll be able to train the dweller who's coming out of there because oh, they cool. get healed up when they go there, and then that arrow trains them as they're being removed. Very cool. Yeah, you learn a little while you're healing yeah, up. Yeah, yeah. You're in the science level. lab. Oh, well, very generous of you there. Free energy. <laughs> what do I want? <laughs> I'll take a water. Mm. All right. Uh, so then we recall? Yep. Yeah. All right. Oh, look at all these dwellers. What am I even going to do with so myself? Many people. I only have three. I need to start working on that. <laughs> okay. Um, uh, all right. Threats. <laughs> Sorry, just keep myself in frame here. Yeah. <laughs> um, all right. So threats at the top level. Yep. Uh, on an eight. Mm -hmm. Oh, that water treatment plant is filling up. Fortunately, my Nuka Cola bottler is completely <laughs> free and who available need, who for Who needs water when you have soda? <laughs> Uh, then on my level, a six. Unfortunately, no, that's, oh. That's rough. Mole rats. Mole yeah. rats. All right, Evan's level here. On a six, you're still no. safe. Totally good. Molly. <laughs> a seven, seven. you're <laughs> safe. All right, good. All right, Evan, you're still first player? <sighs> yes, yes I am still first player. Or this, this is the first round that I've been first player. But, uh, Oh, did you steal it from me last round? I stole round? it from you last I'm just so yes. used to being, you know, <laughs> yeah. having it. Even one round yes. without it feels <laughs> terrible. Hmm. Enjoy being third player. <laughs> yeah. Let's see. Gotta get crafty. I'm going to go here and grab two food and a water. Well, alas, I'm going to give Evan extra resource there because uh, i've got to yes. use your living quarters yes, please if you don't mind oh no it's always available me and business. my friend would like to make a friend <laughs> 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 we're recruiting online that's yeah, what it is <laughs> exactly i'm gonna go to that training spot again i'm going to i'm gonna build let's keep it rolling uh three energy and a food 
Let's build this science lab. All right. And two happiness. Mm -hmm. All right. All right, we're getting closer. Evan only has two rooms left to build, and he's yeah. getting one around, so yeah. I might need to speed things up here. <laughs> mm, so now the question. I'm going to go fight this rad scorpion, Aww. me and my missile launcher. All right, here we go. I need some dice, please. Oh, yeah. So it hits on an eight or higher, but I have a, the ability to re-roll, so yeah. let's see. Nine, oh, yeah. great. All right, dead. So I'm going to take a happiness and also a resource of my choice. I'll take up water, actually. There we go. Very nice, very nice. All right, I'm going to go grab two power. Hmm. But not for my own room, because that way, if you guys want to power, you've got to come, <laughs> come knocking over here at my, my mole rat filled nuclear reactor. If anyone's tired of their item, I recommend getting three resources of your choice at the outfit workshop. Uh, and actually... just as a reminder to everyone, the game will end when someone fills out their entire level of the vault. Whoever has the most happiness wins. Or, someone. Or when the threat deck runs out. Yeah. Just. Whenever someone like builds so, their six like about halfway through the threat deck. Whenever somebody, uh, <laughs> yeah. hmm. I'm going to uh, injure someone for a happiness. Oh, you can make them injured over there. Yeah. yeah so that's because awesome. the injure, that's crazy. because the injure icon is in the cost, you yeah. actually uh, injure that dweller to get the happiness. Oh, that's very cool. They're getting the brawl, you know, yeah, over yeah. their game of poker. <laughs> and I'll take a resource for you uh, injuring yourself in my game room. Oh uh, yes, of course. Thank you. Of course. Thank you. We, we appreciate your business. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> Except for all the brawls. <laughs> Are you yeah. out over there, Molly? I'm out. Yeah. Okay. Hmm. I've been slower to increase my dwellers because I was third player for so long. There wasn't anywhere to put my dude for mm -hmm. a long time mm -hmm. to get a guy. Mm -hmm. Plus, there's a, a death claw <laughs> in the other states. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Well, I, I, I kind of want to clear up my nuclear reactor here. So I'm going to send myself to these mole rats. Exhaust my shotgun. So a six plus. I just need a four plus. So how can I fail? How can you fail? You couldn't possibly. Hey. hey, 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 hey. All right. Hmm. I'm in the lead, which means now is a poor time to gamble. But no, I really, that was the best time to I gamble. I really want to kill that death claw, though. Mm, uh, you should do it. Do no. you have any way to get trained in E? No, no, Fight no. Fight the death claw. Oh, that Fight would be, that would be sweet. Um, no, we're going to... How are we going to do this? Let's see. I need... Well, I need another dwell to make sure I get maximum camera points. So we're just gonna we're just gonna have find a friend here. All right. Working quarters. Okay. Is that everyone? Or you oh, still, no, I've got you still, still have two, two dwellers. Go, wow, and... I am way behind on dwellers. Hmm. Well, I don't know if anybody's visiting my nuclear reactor this round, and I need the power, so I'm going there for two. Mm -hmm. do, do you have one left, or is that guy nope, here? Nope. This All guy right. is uh, my unclaimed gentleman. Um, I've not found him yet. <laughs> the unclaimed gentleman sounds like some sort of like like a superhero, right? Like, yeah. <laughs> I haven't found him in the living quarters. Oh. How are you going to the bed? So I was kind of hoping because it's looking like you're going to end the game here pretty quick. I was kind of. He doesn't have a lot of resources. I was kind of hoping to build a room with my last dweller here, but I really want that water treatment purification plant. Mm. But it needs two water. Mm -hmm. uh, well, I think I need to get the room because I think I'm going to find myself a little happiness poor at the end of the game here. Mm. And what are you going to build? The garden? The radio station? I think it's got to be the garden. Like, we already mm -hmm. have a lot of dwellers and we're kind of approaching the end of the game, so I think the radio station's not a great bet. Mm -hmm. So, three power and two food to build that garden. Yes. Plus, you never know when the diner's going to be infested with rad scorpions. <laughs> it's another garden. Another garden. And that brings me up to six happiness. All right. All right, so that's the end of the round. Yeah. Um, so we can go ahead and recall. Excellent. Yes. This poor boy laying down. Mm -hmm. Got rid of the rad scorpion from the water treatment plant. Yes. And I have a choice about where to train here. <laughs> I mean, do I take the risky play and train an E to go try to fight that death claw? Yes! Mm -hmm. But that you need might happiness. Just force somebody's hand to block me here. I think the safer play is to train an S. Mm -hmm. All right. All right, let's spawn some threats. And so, right. top level, we've got an eight. eight. Uh, that water treatment plant just wants to right? stay completely infested. Yeah. 
It's like they're letting their friends in the back door or something. <laughs> All right, then on my level, um, we've got a six. Oh, oh no! More I trained an ass. <sighs> Can't curse on stream. <laughs> 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 on Evan's level here. Uh, seven, you're I mean, safe. You could curse the rad roaches and all their descendants. <laughs> <laughs> and then Molly's level here uh, a on ten. a 10. That's, so yeah, that's that empty it. space yeah, there, so yeah. you're safe. Um, also, now might be a good time to mention there is one uh, uh, other thing. In addition, for scoring at the end of the game, uh, you're going to lose a happiness for each threat that's still present on your level of the vault. That is good to notice. Mm. So make sure to clear off your level before uh, mm -hmm. that final round. Mm -hmm. Okay. All right, Evan, you're up. All right, let's, uh, I don't want anyone else to snipe this first. I'm gonna hurt myself for happiness. <laughs> <laughs> All right, uh, oh, I had a plan and I gotta go back to it here. Was that 10 happiness? 10 You've happiness. got a pretty commanding lead on us right now. We're so happy here. All right, I'm going to spend a water to take this globe because what mostly, it? so what it does is it gives me happiness for every two rooms, mm. but mostly it's because I don't want Evan to have it. Because <laughs> he's got a lot of rooms and that could be bad. Well, that's a good so I, I support spend this. Spend my water there. All right, well I did, I, I sp spent all this effort training my dweller in strength, hoping to get six power in one go. Mm. So I suppose I'll send my trained dweller over here to this S to get mm -hmm. four, four power. power. That's still pretty good. Yeah, and it forces you all to come to my nuclear reactor. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. All right, let's see. We're doing it. We're gonna go fight the Death Claw. Ooh, <laughs> Ooh yeah. All right, all right. These two boys with your excited. minigun with, using the minigun. So I need six plus. All right, that's a, that's a good shot of this. Yeah. Yay! Yeah. Dead. Two happiness. Oh, oh you he are didn't need it. runaway happiness here. <laughs> I don't know. Absolutely. In which Evan crushes us, crushes me at my own game. Yeah, my yeah. people are so happy. <laughs> They're just really thrilled by your. your they just took out a death claw role. with their bare hands <laughs> and a minigun. <laughs> and, you know, their bare count. hands in which they held a minigun. Yeah, they held it with their hands. It counts. All right, I'm gonna go. Let's see, boy. I want to. I want to eventually build another room here. I think, but maybe because I need the happiness for it. So I think what I'll do is go to Fisher's Garden. Yes, and, welcome. And get three food. That's a, that's a good amount there. Can't turn that down. I think I'll... Stealing uh, all your vegetables. <laughs> I'll take a water from uh, your visit here. All right. And I'm going to use that water to build that water purification plant. Oh, mm. finally. There you go. Where would you like it? Uh, I'm going to put it over here. We have a weapon workshop That's pretty coming cool. out here. So it looks like you, when you go to this space, if, when this, once this is built, you can unexhaust a card. Yep. Very cool. Mm -hmm. um, I'm going to slide down to the outfit workshop here. Mm. I'm going to ditch this minigun. Uh, to grab three energy. I'll take a resource for that. Thank you very oh, much. Oh, you could have come to the nuclear reactor. No, no, no. No, no. Yeah. See, there, it's infested with rad roaches. Yeah. <laughs> rad roaches. All right. Time to fight a feral ghoul. It needs to happen. And uh, oh, I didn't really. Oh, you injured yourself for happiness earlier too. So I get a resource for that. I oh yes, notice. yes, please. Did please not do. notice. All right. So I'm gonna fight. I need the dice because I'm gonna fight that feral ghoul. Mm -hmm. uh, seven plus, but mm -hmm. I do have my missile launcher if needed. Uh, nope, got him. So there he is. more happiness for me. Slowly crawling my way up toward y'all. I'm tied with Fisher. Oh yeah. All right. Let's. Yeah, we, we we've got to we've got to do some catching up to Evan here. Oh yeah, your turn. Yeah, I'm being indecisive, I think. <laughs> Gonna grab that training spot. Mm. Yeah. Let's go build. Uh, I'm gonna build... I'm gonna take the weapon workshop here. And cool. two happiness. That's me. I need some more people, and I only have one guy left, so I'm gonna injure this guy here mm -hmm. and spend my water and my food to get a dweller start to, my ranks are thin and I need more, more, yes. uh, more help. Yes. Can't place, can't worker placement game without <laughs> workers to place. <laughs> it's true. All right, well, I think I'm gonna take this dweller here, give him a jumpsuit to train him an A, hand him a handy dandy shotgun to give him a plus two to go fight this rad roach. Oh, mm. snap. So I need a three up 
and I'll get double rewards. It's almost impossible for you to fail. Why would you say that? <laughs> uh, all right, all right, we're fine, we're fine. So close. Uh, and we'll take uh, two resources of my choice. And I'm being indecisive. Yes. You don't have any water. Oh, we need to put it out in our room. Mm -hmm. There we go. Fitness room. Mm -hmm. Yeah, you're right. Fitness room water. on the level. <laughs> All right. Uh, my injured, injured. Actually, I'll guy. do. I'll do a water and a power. Okay. My injured guy here is gonna slide over to my science lab. Very cool. Very smooth. It's gonna get all better. All right, fish. Yep. <clears throat> I don't want to give Evan resources, but I think we're in a half, a bit of a race for happiness at this point. So Evan, I'm gonna go visit your athletics room. Yeah. And eat these three food for a happiness. It's so athletic to eat food. <laughs> <laughs> I'm, true. I'm bulking, you know. Yeah, it's in a bulk, it's in a bulk state. Uh, energy. It's intermittent fasting, and this is not the time to be fasting. It's in the, it's in the eating period. Oh yeah, all right. Um, I think that's everything. So um, nobody else has dwellers? Nope. nope. All right, let's recall. Okay. This guy right. comes back. Trained. These guys right. here, 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 and then my little hurt bud. All right, friendo, we'll get you fixed up. Don't you worry. This guy comes back injured. <laughs> and I gotta train this uh, guy. Injured in the something. smart one. <laughs> 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 Not so smart now, are you? <laughs> <laughs> think All right. I'm gonna train. Oh yeah, that's right. Yeah, I have to choose yeah, before have to threats choose. come out. Hmm. You can see the top one. Yeah, yeah, I can see the top. I think we're gonna do E because of that. Yes. And let's see what comes out. All right, top level. On a seven, All nothing right, comes nice. out. On my level, two. Oh. All the way down here, that glowing rad scorpion. Glowing rad scorpion. On Evan's level. We've uh, got a 10. Oh, uh, yeah. That'll do it. 10 Let's is see. here. More and then lastly, on Molly's level, we have a 5. Curses! And so 5 already has an enemy. Oh, phew. I so thought the 5 was another, the next uh, one. Over, a, so. a threat, so nothing spawns That's there. That's lucky. All right. All right, Evan, you're up. Yes. Uh, let's see. Are there any sweet eye places that I should grab right at the beginning? Uh... So there's a couple good eyes out there. They're yeah. down at the outfit workshop on Molly's level. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I definitely recommend you can, going down there. We have mm -hmm. the best stuff. You can double get double items, which is a pretty unusual one. Um, mm -hmm. There's also, with eye, you can double your payout on discarding an item. Yeah. But I yeah. doubt you want to discard that camera at this no, stage of the game. No, that's three happiness. Um, I really just want to keep rocking this train I've got, so I'm going to injure someone for happiness. All right. Right. Letting you keep first player may <laughs> may be the ultimate downfall here. But... Hmm. Okay. <clears throat> I just think right off the bat, I'm going to send my guy to get healed here and train. Yes. He'll come back trained yes. and I. Be welcome yes, here. Take your resources. Yes. All right, well, I think I'm just going to immediately use my Dweller trained in E to go fight that Glowing Rad Scorpion before you, it, either of you scoop it from me. I'll give plus two with my shotgun. So uh, I just need a seven plus. Just. Just. Oh, no. got there. All right. So because I was trained, I'll, I'll get two happiness and two uh, resources of my choice. Nice. Mm -hmm. Nice, nice, nice. Let's do. I've got this guy trained in eye. Let's go. I want a. Hmm. I'm gonna go here and get a food and a water. I'm going to spend a water to get an item. And I'm going to take the military fit. Oh, no, no, the lab coat. This yes. one, the lab coat. Formal wear. Sauce to train in luck. Mm-hmm. Nick? All right, I think I'm going to spend two water Ooh. to go refresh the item track. Ooh. So that refreshes it, and that allows me to grab one. So we'll discard these three and get three new ones out here. <laughs> 
All right, so we've got a couple, one that trains in E, one that trains in C. Doesn't look like there's a lot of enemies to fight with E out. And then the other one gives you, at the end of the game, happiness oh, yeah. for every item you have or uh, every coat? E each outfit. So outfit. the mm -hmm. ones with this little icon here. Sure. I only have one, but given that we're kind of entering the end game here, I will mm -hmm. take that one mm -hmm. for the happiness. That's the, that's what I would have taken. Were I in your position? Hey, there's a cat. It's a Maine Coon. <laughs> <laughs> Big kitty. <laughs> <laughs> Polydactyl. <laughs> Let us go get some energy. All right, I'm going to train my dweller here in I using my lab coat. And then I'm going to go fight the Sparrow Ghoul on my level. And I need a 7 plus to hit. And if I do, I get double rewards, which is good for me right now. Hey, hey great. Goodness. Didn't even have to use my missile launcher. All right. So two happiness for me, which is... You strap the missile launcher to your back just in case. You never know when you need it. It's I'd rather need it and not have or have it and not need it. Yeah, exactly. It have it. Exactly. That's how I feel about my missile launcher. Yeah, at home. exactly. That's right. That's why you pack <laughs> it right under the table. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> All right. Um, so I'm gonna use my jumpsuit to train an A, and then go over to my garden and take six food. Oh my gosh! Just Yikes. fill up that track all in one yeah. go. Yeah. Do you get a number of happiness at the end of the game for the resources you have? Uh, you don't, but uh, uh, there's going to be some tiebreakers if we end up if somebody ends up tying. Sure. Um, I believe uh, it's total number of uh, resource cubes is the first tiebreaker, mm -hmm. um, and then I think it's number of dwellers and then number of items. Got it. Um, if you tie in all of those, uh, the two of you are just going to have to learn how to uh, run the vault together. <laughs> <laughs> All right, I'm going to build. Let's do some end game. So three energy and a water uh, fitness room. You know. There's your last space. Yep, two happiness. So the game will end then at the end of this round. So by the end of this round, you mean one that's at the end of the threat phase or, at, or before the threat phase? Um, at the, oh, before the threat phase. Okay, so once we've placed our last workers, yep. that's when the game will end. So technically, actually, the threat phase is at the beginning. You just skip it the first round. Got sure. Because there's sure. nowhere to put anything. Yep. Mm hmm, hmm, hmm. Oh, I can build that. Oh, snap. Well, hey, all right. I'm going to go build this, myself a room. Yeah. With all of my, almost all my remaining resources. And build this nice lounge, everybody. Come join me on the third floor lounge, where oh, your injured lounge. dwellers can uh, spend food for stim packs and happiness. Yes. <laughs> got your happiness. Got my happiness. And we have a, a theme workshop. Yeah, the theme workshop's interesting, because it's the only other space in the game besides your elevators that lets you build another room. Oh. So okay. it can actually accelerate the end of the game. The one downside of building from that space instead is that it only gives you one happiness instead of the two for the room. Sure. So you usually only want to trigger it if you're ahead and trying to end the game quickly. Mm -hmm. Sure. Um, sure. All right. I'm going to go build a room myself. Yeah. So we'll spend three power, two food, and build that garden for two more happiness. Mm -hmm. More garden. All right. Uh, let's see. I'm going to send my guy trained in I to go fight this feral ghoul. No weapons, but we'll roll the dice and see what comes up. You need a seven or higher? Uh, yes! <laughs> <laughs> yes, more ghouls in our vault. <laughs> I just got really excited because I was like, oh, I could go to Fisher's nuclear reactor and get three energy and then I could build this classroom, but I don't have another guy to do oh, the building. Oh, one no. dweller left. Like one oh. dweller. If I had one more dweller, I could like totally build another room and then I would, my globe would be worth more points, but alas. So I guess I'm just going to try to get whatever happiness I can out of life. Uh, <laughs> since I have a food. Uh, oh, now you have to be injured three. to go there. This one over here, you can discard an item for a happiness. So if there's an item you don't really need here that's at the end true. of the game. That's true. I don't need the missile launcher anymore, so that's a good idea. And also, it gives Evan something. <sighs> that's fine. Don't discard that and gain one more, one more little happiness eked out. Get some water. All right. So I have my last dweller here too. Looks like a lot of our. Ha so I, I could go to that space and get uh, a happiness for three food. Um, is there any other items that are any 
Mm. Nothing that will help mm -hmm. you too much, it looks like. What does the main coon do? Um, you can exhaust it and discard one of your existing items to grab one from the track. So oh, it just lets sure. you kind of cycle out items for better options later on. That makes sense. Hmm. They have grippy paws. <laughs> so you send them out and they come back like this. <laughs> um, well, I could grab another item from one of these workshops, and uh, if I grabbed another outfit, that would give me a happiness. But in the end, I think it's the same. It's just going to get me one happiness for this last dweller. So mm -hmm. um, you can fight those mole rats. Oh no, those aren't on your level. It's, uh, it behooves you to leave those at this point. Yeah, yeah. I want Evan to have those. Um, <laughs> we'll put them in a nice little terrarium. Yeah, yeah. That's great. I <laughs> uh, will. Yep. Yeah, I'm just going to go to Evan's level here. Spend three food to get one last happiness. Yeah. Get on All my right. level. <laughs> you get one more resource just yeah, in case it matters. Yes, I do. All right. Uh, I'm going to send my injured guy down here to uh, spend a food and heal up and get a happiness. Mm -hmm. There you go. All right. Well, we do uh, recall our dwellers here at the end. It just matters for clearing off of the clearing the off the threats. Sure. I think Evan might have this one in the bag. I think so, but I don't know if we kept caught up to him. Let's, All right. Let's so, count up this happiness. Yeah. So to total up, just count up your total tokens, any happiness you gain from items, and then uh, discard or minus one for each threat on your level. Yes. I have 14 happiness with my globe. I have 20 happiness. Oof. All right. I only... Oh, did you discard one for your... I did. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Thought I was going to get you down into the teens with us. Um, uh, I just get one for my Yaogoi hide for a total of 15. So good, good work, game. Evan. Yeah. Congratulations, new overseer. I promise that uh, at the beginning of my reign, I will not bloodily execute those who oppose me. I was going to say, now we have to live with him. Can I just stay on my level, sir? <laughs> yes. I wasn't worried about execution, and now I am. You may all maintain, uh, you know, sub-leadership of your own level. Oh, uh, that's very generous of you. Kind. Tribute will be expected at regular intervals. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, okay, so this was Fallout Shelter, the board game. Uh, <laughs> thank you everyone so much for watching. This game is planned to come out in April of this year, uh, so early here in the second quarter, just a couple of months away. Uh, you'll probably be able to play it at some uh, at some shows um, that you may go to, uh, where we where we'll be demoing this around the world. Uh, but thank you everyone so much for watching. We stream every Tuesday and Thursday. Come back on Thursday. We're going to be announcing a new hero pack for Ooh. Marvel Champions. Heck yeah. Talking with the designer, <laughs> showing off some cool new cards. It will be sweet. Uh, follow us on Instagram, Twitter, and Facebook. Thanks to Carolina Game Tables for this awesome table. Uh, watch our videos over on YouTube uh, where this will be archived later. And we'll catch you next time.